Hi everyone. Today we are going to see how we can integrate Microsoft Teams with Business Central. As we know, Microsoft Teams is a Microsoft 365 product that lets you connect with others, collaborate seamlessly, and simplify work. Business Central offers an app that connects Microsoft Teams to your business data in Business Central, so you can quickly share the details across team members, look up details, and respond faster to inquiries. The app is available on the Teams Marketplace, and you can use it with the Teams desktop app, mobile app, or web. To connect Microsoft Teams with Business Central, you must have a Teams license and a Business Central user account. The first thing that you need to do is go to the Assisted Setup, and you need to run the Teams app Centralized Deployment option to complete the setup. You can just click on it and complete the setup. Just click on Next, and then Done, that's it. Now the setup is complete for the Teams and Business Central integration. Then, after you have completed the setup, you can open Teams. You can simply go to the App Launcher and select Teams. In Business Central, you can also assign permissions for the users that you want to give permission to use this functionality. Here I have created a test user and given it the permission to use this functionality, and you can see it has the read-only permission. Now you can go to the chat option in Teams, and here you can select the Business Central app option. To change the company from the Teams app, just right-click on the Business Central icon here and click on Settings. Here a page opens, and you can select the company that you want to use. You can also search for users that you have already created in Business Central. And on the chat section, you can click on these three dots, click on, find the app, and then search for, Business Central. Open the app for the user. You will be searching in Cronus. To change the company, you can follow the steps that we discussed earlier in the video, and then you can share the desired data with the user from the selected company in Teams. You can also add tabs from Business Central on the top of the Teams channel or chat. Let's create a new team chat here. Click on the Create Team option, and you can create it from scratch. Here, we will create a private chat. Give a team name, we will name it Business Central, and enter the description. You can add users to this chat group, and you can also add multiple users. You can make them a member of the group or the owner of this group, click on the drop down and select one of the options, and then just click on close. On the top of the team chat, you can also add the Business Central tab. To do that, you can just click on the plus sign at the top of the screen and search for Business Central. You can change the company from here. Here you can assign which company data you want to display. And here you can choose which table of the tab content you want to see at the top of the chat. Just select one of the options from the drop down. Here we are going to select customers and then just click on save. Now you can see all your customers related to the Sinotech company displayed here. You can view these directly in the Teams chat. You can also add more tabs here. To do that, you can again go to the Add tab option and select the Business Central app. We will change the company again, select one of the options, and click on Save. We'll select some items and then hit the Save button. Now, you can see on the top of the chat the two new tabs that you've added from Business Central here. You can see the items. All the items that you are going to sell to your customers that are available at the company that you selected will be displayed here. You can also share information directly with Teams from Business Central. For example, if you want to share this item's information, go to the Share option and select Share to Teams. A new window will open, prompting you to sign into your Business Central account. Then, when you have signed into your account, you can select the user or group that you want to share this information with. We will select the test user, and you can also select multiple users here, and then just click on the share option. Once the link has been successfully shared, you will see this message on the screen that your link has been shared. You can then just close this window and go to Teams. 
Here in Teams, on the chat option, select the user that you shared the information with. And here you can click on details to see all the details of the item that you shared, it will open the entire item card right here. The user that you shared the information with will now be able to view the details of the product directly from Teams without going to Business Central. So, this is how you can integrate and use Teams and Business Central. It could be helpful to share information, it allows you to act on your Business Central data without leaving Microsoft Teams. Thank you.